communication is confidence. Why do we say it? Well, firstly, it's good alliteration, but more seriously, one leads to the other. Toastmasters has a mission. It's had a mission for a very long time that if that basically says if we learn to communicate better, we get our point across better. People understand it more and they indicate that. So we think, oh, well, I did that. I did that reasonably well. I'll do it again. And to quote uh, Darren Lacroix, who won the World Championship of Public Speaking in 2001, I think it was, there are only three components to confident communication. Number one is stage time. Number two is stage time. And number three is stage time. So if you want to c communicate with confidence, get yourself some stage time. My vision for the communicate uh, communication is confidence. I like to think that we'll have people finding their voices. You never know what's going to happen when a person finds their voice. Well, I've seen people come in to Toastmasters who couldn't really string two sentences together. And in a reasonably short space of time, certainly a couple of years, they've been inspired because they have a passion to go out and become spokespeople. I think that is what I'd like to see, that, that uh, people moving from, I could never do that, to, oh, maybe I can do it, to, I'm enjoying this, let's do some more. And that's what I see this campaign as, uh, as, as progressing. I, I want to see people gain that confidence and I want to see them say, that the reason I gained that confidence was that I came up through Toastmasters. How do I want others to get aboard? Willingly is the first, uh, is the first thing that came to mind. But uh, the main thing is that I would like to see others learning to, to lead. We see communication and leadership within what we do. But the leadership comes from the role of a leader. That's simply to create other leaders. They, a good leader won't do, anything, won't do anything else. They'll be training their successor, if you like. So if you're going to come on board with this and, and help with find, helping people find their voice, there will be a leadership component and you'll you will enjoy and benefit from that. But the whole idea is it's all about the person who doesn't have the confidence you have. Think about where you got it and learn to give it to them. That's what I'd like to see people do within this campaign. That's, a two, that's actually two stories. One was, why did I go to Toastmasters? And one, why did I join? I went to Toastmasters because of my boss. I'd seen him over five years turn from a mouse who went to sleep in, in client meetings into someone who uh, could supply a reason why I would follow his leadership. And I, I actually asked him what the difference was you know what what had, what had happened to him over the last five years and he gave me a card that said Toastmasters and he said why don't you go along so that's the first half the second half was a gentleman called Brett Rutledge who won the world championship of public speaking in 1998 at the, my very first meeting he was on his way to the states and he was practicing now his speech had something like 70 odd voices in it impersonations and he strung them all together as a seven minute humorous speech just amazing and i was listening to this first time out hadn't even joined and i thought i was thinking well i could never do that and i must have been thinking out loud because the guy next to me said you could be right 
It's not a question of whether you can do it or whether you can't do it. Do you want to try? I decided I did, and that's why I joined 20, almost 23 years ago now, and I haven't regretted it for one moment. I'm hoping that the impact of this will be twofold. One, it will raise the profile of Toastmasters as um, a training tool is not quite the right word, but uh, something that will in, enhance people's lives and by finding that voice that, uh, that I've been talking about. The other impact is that we will not just put on members, we will put on committed members, people who know why they're there. Too many people just join to improve communication skills as opposed to I'm doing X so I need to communicate better about X. I would like to see people have greater certainty about where they've, uh, why they joined, where they've come from, and what, where they want to go, even though that changes over time. Because then others can see that uh, progression in people, as I saw it in my manager when he first um, gave me the card that said Toastmasters, as I, because he turned from uh, a mouse into a leader. People who want to do that, or think they might want to do that, are the backbone of Toastmasters. I'd like to see many more of them. <laughs>